G'day, I'm Bart Irwin from NT Field and Game, and I'm just going to show you how I clean, clean the geese, uh, the, the areas I take, and uh, later I'll show you how I cook them. Careful cut along the breastbone, down trying to ensure you retain the tenderloin. You can see the tenderloin there. Keep as much on there as possible. Other breast here along the wishbone, down the breastbone. Once again, trying to get as much of that tender line as possible. Breast off. It's such a versatile and adaptable meat, pad A watching Collingwood on a Friday night for the football season. Goose pad A and cold beer and Collingwood winning just makes it for me. <laughs> the goose breasts have no fat in them, so you gotta use, use some oil. And what I often, often do when I'm cooking breasts, is just take, I take that silver skin off. All right, it's the tough bit. And if you shave that off, and it's a bit like skin, skin and barramundi, fill it at the schnitzel size. The seasoning of your choice. Lemon pepper spice blend. I like the all purpose spice as well. Right there. You're only talking a minute or so on each side. Probably about the amount of time it gets to get my beer. You can see that just there, it's starting to starting to cook through a bit there. That's a piece in the field after goose hunt with minimum, minimum pepper. That one's done, as you can see. Bingo. You can't go wrong as long as you don't leave it to, leave it to do its own thing. It's slightly pink. That's all it needs to be. Doesn't take much chewing. Hope you enjoyed uh, this little cooking segment on how to do magpie goose in the field. Uh, thanks for watching Nora Television. Can't wait to see you all in the Northern Territory, out in the swamp, under some goose. <laughs>